I'm sure by now you've heard of Luminar Neo, but I wanna cover the coolest feature. In my opinion, by far the most revolutionary editing tool I've ever seen. And it's only one thing, and it's the relight scene. This thing is absolutely incredible. You have a dark foreground, you have an unlit subject, you can literally relight it to make it look like you had strobes or off-camera flashes or even a camera flash or something on the scene and totally change the look of it. It is amazing. So without further ado, let's just show you what it's all about. Welcome back to the channel, guys. You know who I am, you know what we're all about. So let's get into Luminar Neo and show you how cool this feature is and the difference between it and just raising shadows, because that is a big question. Okay, so here we are in Luminar Neo. Let's start off with the first photo. We're gonna click this one, we're gonna click edit. This is a photo shoot I did a little bit ago and it turned out really great. I loved the way it looked, but it's a little dark. And I did have a strobe. I had a strobe on camera left here and it just, it just is not bright enough. So we could simply go into develop and we could brighten the exposure. But what does that do? That brightens everything. That brightens the whole image, the exposure. That's no good. Now we could also brighten the shadows. And what does that do? That raises all of the shadows independently. So all the shadows in the entire image, it raises. And that looks a little bit better and we could go with that. But this new feature, okay, let's reset that. Scroll down to relight. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna raise this up and that is going to brighten the image that's going to give the brightness up here and you notice it's just affecting her and a little bit over here and then we're going to add some depth to it and you're going to notice that the bricks slowly increase we're going to raise that all the way up so with two adjustments we have gone from this to this that that oh my gosh you guys don't understand how amazing that is i mean that might be a little bright so let's go ahead and lower the brightness just a shade there we go but look, it just, I mean, it affects exactly what I wanted and it creates exactly what I wanted for this image. The tool is incredible and you can adjust the depth. So watch as the light just fades away and comes back. It's just, it's amazing. Now you will notice that the mask here is pretty good, but it missed this spot here. Notice how it's still a little dark. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna click this little mask button here and we're just going to erase it. Notice how we have the erase tool here. We're just gonna make it a little smaller and we're just gonna delete this out here, delete this out here, and delete this out here. That way it's not getting the relight. And there we go, much better. So if the masking isn't perfect, it's very easy to fix because again, it is software, it is not a perfect program. If it was perfect, that would be like, that'd be Skynet Terminator stuff. Skynet defense system we're in. now activated. We wouldn't want that. So this is just a simple way to fix it when it misses parts like that. So now let's look at the difference between the shadows, which is the one on the right, and the relight, which is the one on the left. The shadows, it just kind of looks dull. Yeah, it's a little bit brighter, but again, there's no life to the image. There's no vibrance. It's just kind of dull. The one on the left, it looks like it's just alive, and it just looks so clean and just exactly what I want. So the relight tool worked way better here. So that is awesome. Now, before we get into the next image, I want to thank all of my patrons over on Patreon for supporting this channel. Uh, every little bit counts. If you want, go check it out. I'll put a link in the description. There are many different tiers for you to contribute and some free coaching calls on one of the tiers if you wanna get involved with that. And if you like Sky Replacements, I have two courses. One is free and one is paid. This, the paid one comes with 101 brand new skies that you've never before seen. I took them myself. They're absolutely incredible and so epic. And uh, I'll put a link in the description along with a discount code for the paid version. But you can get the free one or you can get the paid one. Totally up to you. And uh, with that, let's jump into the next next image here. Here's the next image and it looks good as is. I've clearly edited this already, but let's go ahead and uh, up the shadows and just see what happens. So if we up the shadows, it looks good. Yeah, I mean, we could work with that, but it's just kind of uneven. It's all over the place. Again, boosting the shadows, boost the shadows of the entire image. So good. Now let's go down to the relight scene and let's go ahead and boost this a little bit and We'll boost the depth here. Let's see what we want. I think right there is good. Boost a little bit more. All right. And okay, so here's the before and here's the after. 
and it just, it affects just her, which is incredible. I mean, this is absolutely amazing how good this is. Whereas if you look at the difference between the shadows, shadows now on your left and the relight on your right, it just looks so much cleaner. The shadows, again, looks very faded. It looks like you boosted and took out a lot of the contrast. Whereas the relight keeps that original contrast and just makes it look so freaking good. I mean, this just looks like I have a strobe camera right, right on her and then a fill on her left, right in front of her, just kind of casting that light. It just gives us such a much more natural look and can save your image. Let me tell you, it can absolutely save your image and that's why I love this tool so much. And that wraps up this quick little tutorial on how awesome this Relight tool is. Like I said, by far, if I were to keep anything in Luminar Neo, it would probably be this tool. And if you don't have Luminar Neo, I actually put a link in the description. I am not sponsored by Luminar Neo at all. I am an affiliate, so clicking the link and using the link to get it actually does help me out. But this is my true and honest review. So if you liked it, go ahead and hit that like button. If you have any questions, you know what to do. Comment in the description. Subscribe if you haven't already. I'm here every single Monday. But that's it. See you.